Hey, good evening. Dan Fitzpatrick here, stockmarketmentor.com. And suddenly Tesla got really easy. And here's why. Okay, uh, stock's going to be added to the S&P 500 um, before the start of trading on December 21st. And so that means that every fund that tracks the S&P 500 has to have Tesla in its stocking before Santa Claus comes down the chimney after parking his EV sled up on the roof with Rudolph's glowing nose, certainly an LED light, I'm sure. So that's going to be a lot of buying that's going to have to happen. But the thing is, it didn't happen today. I mean, I'm sure there was some buying for every share um, that was sold and there was over 61 million of them. Somebody bought that share. So there was buying here, but the sellers really overwhelmed it. You could see like right out of the chute, stock gaps up and then it trades off um, immediately. And so why am I saying Tesla got really easy? This is why, because you don't want to fart around with this as long as it's in this box. I, I mean, this is not, this is not your friend. Um, you know, we can go to an hourly chart, whatever you want. This is not your friend. This is a chart that you just want to stay away from unless you want to gamble because it literally is, you, you know, you're just, I know if you're a day trader, you can be going like, oh, you know, I can trade this. Well, you go on ahead and do that. I want to go make some money someplace else. And this is not a place where you're going to make money. It's a place where you're going to basically give it away to somebody else. So don't do that. Instead, um, just do it this way. This is the top. We'll call it 460. It's actually 462, but we'll call it 460. Set a price alert at 460 on your software. Don't wait for my alert to come to you. It's by email. You may be getting a cup of coffee or in the restroom or something. So don't wait for that. But set an alert on your software trading, you know, on your trading platform to fire off at 460. And that is when you want to consider buying Tesla. You always want to look at the chart. But until Tesla breaks through 460, or again, actually 462, but until it breaks through there, you shouldn't want any part of Tesla. It's just a money-sucking fiend. Once it breaks through 462, then it literally has just blue sky because this last resistance level here from back in early September, those, those sellers are long gone. Anybody who's losing money on, on this trade here, um, they've already liquidated their shares or they're just not going to sell. Um, in either event, they're not going to give you the kind of resistance that you might think you're going to get. All the resistance is right here at 460. Once this thing breaks through, that's your huckleberry. Your next stop will be 500. Who knows after that? I don't. I ain't going to tell you I do. All right. That's it. See you all next time.